What characterizes Dane's design is often described as uh, clean lines, simplicity, attention to details, and very high quality craftsmanship. This group that I'm sitting in here is a good example. The sofa here by the famous Anna Jakobsen, the chairs, the table by the architect Paul Kerhorn, and they are very simple in lines and at the same time very beautiful and exquisite in their forms. Anna Jakobsen also designed the famous swan chair. What characterizes the swan chair is again no straight lines, just curves, and it resembles the swan. Anna Jakobsen also in the mid 1950s designed the famous uh, seven chair which is a conference room chair and that has been now produced for more than 60 years. Our guests coming to the embassy were in the embassy's reception be met by the uh, shell chair which is another example of simple but beautiful lines and curves that have now lasted more than 40 years. At the embassy and here in my residence, all our lamps are of course also Danish design. The most famous of them is probably the artichoke designed by Paul Henningsen. And what is characteristic is that the source of light is hidden. The light coming out from the lamps are only indirect and thereby get a softer tone and it gives a very pleasant atmosphere. Among the most well-known design icons is Royal Copenhagen and George Jensen. Royal Copenhagen was founded in the late 18th century, but has, based on old designs, has updated one of its most popular designs, and that is today the blue fluted mega tableware. At the table, we see the uh, silverware, Bernard Dodde, which is a, a classical example of the Art Deco style that was popular uh, just before the Second World War. It is still today seen as timeless elegance. Bang & Olufsen's audio products combines the most sophisticated high-tech with great design, creating a loudspeaker that many people think is a sculpture, but it is in fact one of the world's most sophisticated loudspeakers. Nowhere in the world is Danish design probably appreciated more than in Japan because the Japanese people are able to appreciate the strength and the qualities of Danish design. That goes for both the classics in Danish design, it goes for the young designers of today and tomorrow building on the classics, it goes for the whole range from furniture but also everyday objects that you use in, in the kitchen or on the table. It is my hope that everyone on this design navy will find new inspiration, new ideas for what Danish design of today have to offer.